。洛杉矶联合学区是全美第二大学区，共有六十六万五千名从幼稚园到十二年级的学生。为了帮助广大学生从小养成每日均衡饮食的习惯。洛杉矶联合学区在营养早餐、午餐和点心的食物配置上，都请营养专家做了高于联邦标准的改善，让学生每天可以享用到新鲜又营养的膳食，影响更健康的未来。洛杉矶联合学区的六十六万五千名幼稚园到十二年级学生中，有八成符合全美在校享用营养餐点资格，包括早餐、午餐和课后点心。为了帮助学生吃得更健康，洛杉矶联合学区提供的餐饮有百分之七十二来自洛氏方圆两百英里内的农田和牧场，以确保食物新鲜度，并依年级不同提供多元化的五大营养来源，供学生自由选择搭配。Each day we provide a protein, a meat meat alternate. We provide a fruit, a vegetable, a grain bread, or a, a dairy item, a milk item. Most of all those items are fresh prepared, fresh fruits and vegetables. For an example, we don't serve canned fruits. We don't serve canned vegetables. We've done various different menu items like pad thai. We've done a variety of different rice bowls. We have a teriyaki rice bowl that's on the menu. It's one of the top favorites of all of the students in the district. So we've really Tried to look at the menu as a cultural palette of a map of, you know, working with all students in the district to be able to make sure that that they know what it is and like it. 过去只有三成学生有吃早餐习惯，但在学校提供营养早餐后，已经有九成学生有吃早餐。不仅对健康有益，也增加学习效率。In Los Angeles County, we've seen the obesity trend rates going down. The obesity uh, epidemic that's happening across Los Angeles County, we've seen now is leveling off, and we've actually seen that it's declining in Los Angeles. And the county has actually said it's in no coincidence that the district changed a lot of the food that the children were receiving. So we're seeing we're seeing much healthier citizens. Citizens and productive citizens in Los Angeles County. 尽管学区近几年面临政府补助预算紧缩，导致每份餐点平均成本增加零点五元，但学区仍坚持只用联邦农业部合格食材，每日新鲜现做，并以高出联邦营养标准程度提供学生最佳膳食选择。